professional makeup artist and today is another makeup story day. Let's all welcome <laughs> Let's all welcome my beautiful guest, the athletic muse of Davao! <laughs> Trisha Santos! Hi. Former BBB housemate. It was in the year 2010, so that was almost 11 years ago. Oh my gosh, really? Yeah. Gamay so, pake ko. What's your age? Ato? I was 14. Uy, 14 pa ka? Yeah. Oh my gosh, uh, after 11 years, kami nakashoot me. <laughs> Actually, <laughs> nakailan ni Trisha because back sila sa akong cousin, si yeah. Fritzy. Nibalik siya again few years ago and then now. Yeah. So after 11 years, no, I'm not a makeup chair. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, thank you, Trish. And now, my makeup na me. Yeah. So, let's get so started. Excited. So, first time I ever who make up me. <laughs> and, let's see this. Peg. Okay. So, um, Peg today is the Vika from Peg. Thailand. Very fresh. Long. <laughs> Actually, similar to the pictures. It's like a baby. It's like a baby. I wish. After din ako makeup up. So first, mag moisturizer sa ta. Kaya yun na lang. Serum. I prefer serum over moisturizer. So this one is from Origins. Okay, so today we're gonna try the BLK on her. I'm so excited. This is their new skin tint. Actually, they have their original skin tint, mm -hmm. but this one is illuminating. More dewy, shine, finish, glowy. glowy. But um, I recommend this girl for normal to dry skin. But yeah. if you have oily skin, maybe. Less lang yung may butang. But let's try. Okay, first time nina ko na use it. And I'm gonna use the shade Butterscotch. Okay, let's try it. So very light residue actually. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very sheer actually, very sheer. So I will apply this before mm -hmm. the foundation for a little bit nightmark il sheen yeah. before the foundation. Yeah. For the kayo mark dry skin. Mm -hmm. And then foundation. Oh, so sigi go chica. So next start ka. You said 14 years yeah, old. Yes, so when I was 14. So was that a dream? Na, uh, mag -artista ko. No, it wasn't really a dream because mm -hmm. the dream has always been to play. I've been an athlete mm -hmm. most of my life. Mm -hmm. I started in basketball. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, before, yeah. Before, yeah. But your height so I'm not that tall. You are, wait. Until I mean, for the Philippines, yeah, but what? Kabalo ka ka to na to make America, mm -hmm. mga abot paglad na mo din na. Kola, gumaya na ko. Versa, here's the Philippines, taas na yung kayo. Yeah. Five, five, eight. Five, eight. Mm -hmm. Anyway, so to be continued, and then, unsa na yeah. sport? Um, I've played volleyball most of my life. Yun yung kinarier ko talaga. But on the side, like, I enjoy actually all kinds of sports. Really? Yeah, I like trying. I like learning mm -hmm. and moving. But what's among your favorite sport? Volleyball. Volleyball. Yeah. Oh. yeah. So varsity ka since? Yeah, I played for um, UST. But um, I had to stop playing because no college ako, I feel like it's because of the, the stress from like school. school. Stress from like my social life. I didn't really have a social life before. Pero ma, ma pressure man sa to. Mm -hmm. Like when you're young, the you. Yeah, yeah, yeah want to feel like you belong somehow mm -hmm. yeah and also like the training was so rigid mm -hmm. everyone was so competitive and that's why i feel like i i just yes. got really stressed and i got diagnosed with a heart it's not a disease but it's a heart condition yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, so muna ni stop siya ka for a while? Or I, muna gito? Muna gito. After that, like, I couldn't anymore. Oh. Wala ra like, symptoms or anything? Wala Oh, no, I, the, the reason I found out is we were training and I think I collapsed mga three times. Salit? Yeah, so they had to bring me to the hospital and then, oh, yeah. okay. Okay, so serious station of condition. Which was, yeah. Like, I really wanted to play, but mm -hmm. I didn't have any plans on, like, pursuing men mm -hmm. or law, which, like, they're known for. Mm -hmm. Like, I really didn't have intentions. Like, I just wanted to play. So, <laughs> when when I got diagnosed with a heart condition, my world just, you know, crumbled down. And I was going to change of environment. So, you said to know all your life, you're going to 
It's all I've ever wanted. Oh. But it's my blind dream. So <laughs> This is so embarrassing. Love. Like, my ultimate goal and dream in life, ever since, ever since bata pa ko, is to be a housewife and to be a mother. Because <laughs> it's bata. Yeah. Yeah, because um, my parents were really busy when, while I was growing up. Mm. And marag nakakita ko sa kong classmates before their parents were very hands-on. But wala mm. nagulang akong mom, but of course, like, she had mm. business to, like, attend to. I'm sure they love me mm. just as much. They man pa sabot na nagkula tong parents no, but kana mga yes. things na we want to improve, of course, atong ganahan to improve sa atong family na yes. yan soon, di ba? Of course, like we want better lives not only for ourselves but also for our offspring, di ba? Ang future na family. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah. So to be continued again sa atong topic about kaning imong PBB life. Yeah. Makaremember pa? I do, honestly, but wala gid ko ni tan-aw ang episode. Ever? Na, ever. Sa TV na, na. Yeah. Because, eh, ikan. So, cringy. Pag ganang uh-huh. makita, ang gitan ako kung sad. Like, ha? Huh? Ngano ka, girl? <laughs> like, nani ka? Aren't they lagi kayo? Mura kong ma-cringe, bitaw. Okay, unsay mo most memorable memory? Oh, there was an episode there where it was my birthday and gamay rin ni Agto uh-huh. because do kami na birthday sa bahay. So, they were asked to pick. Wait, so sorry. Pwede yung guests sa sa soon sa house? No, no, no. Like, the housemates lang were asked ah, okay. to pick like which party they wanted to attend mm-hmm. to. And then, gamay rin niya ito na ako. And then? Which, I thought before, would it really be a problem? Mm-hmm. Because I've always been, I mean, growing up, I've been used to like being alone, raba. So I've been like, "Murag, okay, okay raman siya." Okay. But you know, honestly, <laughs> honestly, murag ko na trauma gamay. You know, ever since then, murag wa pagit ko ni celebrate og birthday bitaw na wala ko yung anxiety before. Really? Yeah. Really yeah. really feel bad ka to na time. Yeah, like am I not important yeah. enough? Murag yeah. na ba? Yeah. Or anong di man mo Like, am I really that bad of a person? Ting <laughs> ana, but then I realized that people are scared mong good there. Like. Mm-hmm. People are scared about the things that they don't understand. So if you're not alike, and it it just it doesn't just apply to me. I feel like you can relate. Everyone can relate to this. Now people just don't get it. When people don't get it, they get scared and they keep their distance. Mm-hmm. But I realized also that that's okay because God has a purpose. Ngano ng ibuhat kani ang ina na? Like right now, maybe your purpose hasn't been revealed to you or like to me. But I'm sure that he made us this way because he has a higher and better purpose for us. Yeah, and I did try recent for everything. Yeah. And then sometimes, di din ito makasabot, but di ba eventually, makayong ka, hala mo di, or no? Yeah. Mo di ni happen to before, kaya mo di ni siya ang purpose ni mo. Di ba ka? Mo di ang api-api siya ka. Isa si Carissa na nag-make, kaya di ka pili ko ni ko. Isa Carissa na nag-make sa YouTube. Of course, na nga kong share. I mean, na naman yeah. nila ba? So, na nga kong share ako. So, you know, di ba about God? I mean, moment ay pinaka-important and priority sa itong life. And sometimes, mga tao na kalimot na mas busy, mag-share sa about worldly things. Dapat asya po talk ba? Wala na. So, maybe makashare ito sa mga tao and... Yeah. God has His plans for you. But again, He may have not revealed yet. But tama ka na muabot ta sa time na you know when we get to where he wants us to be when we position in the place that he wants us to be na Lord mo di ay no salamat tingo all diba so ano siya then kaniya ko YouTube diba i mean i think God's time kare na time kay dugay na kay ko nag plan oi yeah years ago and ganahan gid ko grabe gid ko ka talented really sad but isa is ganahan gid ko mo share sad kay kibaw pud daghan kay ganahan makeup and then sometimes mga what we see sa YouTube videos complicated kit and all yes. diba and ganahan ko na dapat mas simple unta akong mahatag yes. ba na kada kay mo buhat sa tanang tao like kanya ko yeah. di man sa differ at di ha guys because i want i'm not gonna do this on myself kani every step yeah. muna tagnay lai gid makeup one positive thing about like your YouTube channel mm-hmm. is like when you do this like when you do people's makeup and you just talk about life mm-hmm. yeah because you know the internet it has so much content now it's not hard to find someone that you're gonna relate to anymore mm-hmm. diba? and since you have like different guests with each of your episodes mm-hmm. yeah like different guests different struggles you know different 
experiences. I'm sure the ganon gihap po nagka na makarelate nila that they find it relatable and they're not gonna feel like they're alone, you know, because other people are experiencing these things or other people have experienced this, these things, yeah. their struggles, and they've gotten out of it. No, good. Yung kay like katulad man ay shared about my story. Mer, dekan kayo na karelate niya ako ba kay na happy ko kay at least you know nga you're not alone and normal yes. in your hang na experience. And eventually, okay, na siya. You know, may ano na things pa di ba? Tinood yun na makarelate kani ang mga yeah. tao. We all get to live once, as cliche as that sounds. So just, you know, do whatever makes you happy. You know, de ba or like listen, like dig deep down in your heart. Like for me, this is what I do. I have dates with God. Mm. Kanang coffee ko ako ra usa, wow, and then quiet okay. time pa minawon na ako siya. Like what he wants me to hear, because sometimes like. Sa atong lives ba? Busy kay ta? Diba? Na di na ako siya madunggan ba? True, good na. So I think quiet time is also very important. So this is my brow grip. So this is the spoolie. Actually, any spoolie but naman ko yung free spoolie. And then, immerse siyang dab dab dab. Gamay or good actually as in literally gamay. And then, just brush up. So just brush up. Diba? So no need for water or any. Pinaka nice niya. So either you want a very bushy, fluffy brows, or you just want it groomed like that. Very simple and easy to use. Even mga beginners makayus rani. After using your spoolie, maybe after a few uses, you can just wash it with water or soap, and then matangtang ra ang gel. Makareuse or use this spoolie. Where is that? This is like such a nice product for um low maintenance. Yo, like, kanang on the go. Ka, yeah, on the go lang. Mm -mm, like after pack. Woke up like this. <laughs> so either you will fill in your brows before or after. Mm -hmm. Depending on your preference. Personally for me, before ko, so I fill in before with a pencil and then brow gel. But sa clients, I prefer to do the brow grip first and then powder. Try lang. I mean, experiment. Asa ka comfortable. Mm -hmm. Asa <laughs> So wait, so after si mong PBB ba, ni continue ka to school da yun? Or like, um, naka-stop ka for a while? I stopped for a couple of months and then I went homeschooling. Mm -hmm. How about now? Ano naman imuhang? Like, hindi siya business, guys. Hustle so hard sa DC. Now, I work for my... I have two jobs. Mm -hmm. So, my first job is I work for my family's yeah, family. company, like family business. Mm -hmm. So, what we do is, um, we're into construction. Mm -hmm. We build roads and highways for the government. Mm -hmm. So, ako na lang sa nag side business na lang sa mm -hmm. And what I'm doing now is I'm actually supplying materials for your company and for other companies. Okay. I'm slowly trying to like tap mm -hmm. other companies mm -hmm. so I could supply for them. Actually, she's here in Cebu right now yeah. hi, for projects, Devani, your future projects. Yes. Hopefully. Yeah, hopefully. And I hope it's done Cebu. Cebu. Kapila na ako nag-ingon ni mo, gusto ko mo po yung Cebu. Yeah, yeah, ingon dito. Kapila na good guys. I actually love Cebu. But when was the last time I was here? Yeah. You were Maybe like three, four years ago. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then Karuna next. Tapos nag-coffee pa ta sa unsa. Mm -hmm. Mo pa to? Yeah. And then Karuna ang next. Oh yeah, so you're planning to stay here for good or um, also not? Not really. Of course, like I have to come home to my family. Kasi like for me, like family is really important. Like that's where I built my foundation on. Mm -hmm. So, mauli siya actually soon. Yeah. And then, balik nasa siya again. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Ganahan lagi ko, te. Di ba? So, I applied a brown eyeshadow all over her lid. And then, more siya satin finish. This is something neutral, but satin rin ha, not so shimmery. And then, actually, very simple ang eye makeup. But, lashes lang siya and eyeliner. Muna ito i-try to achieve. I'm sure that the makeup diba is really artistry. Really? It's artistry, yeah. Like I enjoy makeup, but of course, like I can't do it at the level that you are doing it mm -hmm. because obviously, like you have a talent, Aww. you have a gift, Thank you. right? But that doesn't mean dili na ko pa mo enjoy makeup or yes, diba? of course. Yeah, true. Actually, maka experiment magit ka, and there's no right or wrong sa makeup. If masayuk ka, then okay, ra. Erase. Erase. Oh. <laughs> Simple. <laughs> so muna siya ang ko ano part. Tight line. Yes, tight line. So tight line meaning on skin like under your lashes. Yung color and this is gonna make your 
lash line look thicker. Mm -hmm. Because it's just light after open. I really like it when makeup artists do this because I feel like it just opens up the eyes even yeah. more. See, then, oh, wait, look at the makeup. So the difference with just tight line lang ha, tight line or ni, and then ten awan on si nang oh wow, di ba? Mm -hmm. Actually, if you want a very natural eyeliner, you can just do the tight this line. This is actually nice. Nice awesome. ni sa Maybelline line tattoo guys. I'm using the Maybelline line tattoo. This, this is so nice. But there like, ni siya here. No? Parang siya bola ba? Parang siya bola na na. Yeah. And I think ang girls usually ginahan na. More nag makeup na wala ka na. Hindi ba? No, but I feel like that, that's one of the hardest looks to achieve. Ka ng no makeup. Yes, makeup. exactly. Even for makeup artists, that's the hardest cute. Ka ng natural no makeup look. Yeah, I think this eye is. Basa na kay mas dako ng okay, eye. Okay, okay. This one? Uh, mm. So, yun, anagina siya. It's really not symmetrical. And you don't have to beat yourself up about it. Kay normal or mandi, I know. Normal, you do it. As long as. Wala ka. Well, isa sa siguro is confident lang kanu and then yeah. secure ka sa yourself. Kasi yeah. saan sanay mo face, if okay ka, then you're good ka. But of course, di ba, when we were younger, superficial ka ta. <laughs> Tinood! No, oh. no, no. Yeah, to an extent. <laughs> no, murang, anong dilip mo ko? Mm. But then you realize that, you know, you have an advantage over the others too. And then you come to a, a conclusion that it's really not a competition between others and yourself. It's always going to be a competition within you. You know, you can be the most beautiful woman in the world, but if you're not happy and if you're not confident, then wala rabi hapo. Okay, any special request of the guest today? Taste test. Yes. Okay, taste test na lang. X Cafe. So it's a concept store, right? Yeah. So it's a concept store. <laughs> this is original. Can I say sour, sour cream? Sour cream. Let's try it. I think sour cream. So this cream. is the this famous sour mushroom cream. chips by X Cafe. So X Cafe is located in Cebu. What's so funny? Try the sour cream. Blah blah. Let me make mushroom chips, dude. Let's try it. Ang sarili sa Cebu yun yung made local or Philippines. Philippines. Good, good. Ang pilok mo yun na pantos. Lami! Hindi, lami. That's vegan. Wow, lami. Guys, you try this. This is recommends. 135 pesos for... Lami nito grams. 200? 100 grams. 100 grams. This is so good. Guys, bili na kayo. Promise. And I swear. Bili na lami. And it's 135 pesos, guys. And it's not good. And it's good. It's good. It's good. Okay, I have a guess. Okay, say mo asa question. Okay. So, what's your question? What's your routine like when you wake up in the morning? The first thing I do when I wake up is I worship, and I feel like it plays a big role in my security as a person in the sense that it just fills up my cup so much. Like when I praise about God, when I worship about Him, it just fills up my cup and it gives me the confidence that I need to surpass the challenges within the day or whatever it is that I'm going through in my life. Aww. Aww. Nice. Yeah. So a typical day for me here in Cebu would be like, go first to worship and then again like study, read about or like listen to podcasts about current events, stuff like that. <laughs> Who would you recommend for us to listen oh, if ever? Boy. Um, one of my favorites is Stefan Molyneux. Before, he used to have a YouTube channel, but he was the platform. Mm -hmm. Because he was very expressive with his political views, I think. Ah, okay. Now, he's on... He has a podcast. It's called Freedom Main Radio. Um, one of like the content creators that I actually enjoy also is Black Vision Speaks. I thought you were gonna say Blackpink. Oh. No, <laughs> I like Blackpink too. But I listen to them mainly because um, I just... I really don't trust mainstream media anymore. Mm -hmm. I just feel like it's so full of propaganda. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, since we mentioned Blackpink, what's your favorite song and can you sing a particular line from a song? I like yeah. it. <laughs> Go! Special <laughs> gift! I see! Go! To buy me! I don't know how to do it. 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 Look so good, yeah, look so sweet. Look damn good in our two feet. Guys, we're looking so sorry, ice cream. Nice. Special appearance. Okay, so now lips na peachy na lips. Let me see. Okay. Okay, na siya yung mara. Okay, so I think you're going to need to wear more straight out. Lips and then highlighter. Okay, and guys, wait, last last step before anything else. I do the mascara last last step because 
kabantay ko, if I do this first, most of the time, mark na mga powders will stick. So, kinahan, last siya. So that, after all the powders, wala na. Wala na yung mag-stick-stick. Okay, look down. So, this is um, Maybelline Hyper Curl. Look up. So, always apply mascara on your lower lashes. And, of course, Lovely Cosmetics Body Glow. Mm. Is that? Oh. <laughs> it smells so good. Where is it? Kumut ka yun eh. Coconut. No chocolate. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Aura. Hmm. Do I call Aura? Do I call Aura? It's low lang. <laughs> yeah, cut off. Good look. Good hair. Hanana. Smiles. Okay, so this is the finished look. Thai inspired makeup by Davika. Yeah, Davika. Davika, follow her on Instagram. Nice kisha pictures and looks. Mm -hmm. And thank you, Trisha, for joining me. Thank you me. for like, making me look like a decent human. I hope you guys are inspired and I'm going to learn from us. And please don't forget, Trisha has a YouTube video set. Ah. It's on YouTube. Oh, um, YouTube channel. YouTube oh. channel. So, Trisha sorry. Santos. Trisha yeah. sent us. Please follow her and also follow us on Instagram. At it's Trisha S. And Raisa Merced. Oh. So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in our next video. Kapunka for watching! Bye! Yeah, Bisaya, they don't know.